Mayor of West New York, uh, Mayor Felix Roque. <laughs> Mayor of Guttenberg, Gerald Drashoff. <laughs> Mayor of Bayonne, Jimmy Davis. It would take effect July 2015, allowing New Jersey cities to get some of their urban enterprise zone money back. Assembly Speaker Vincent Prieto has the company of more than a dozen Democratic mayors to announce the new push. The urban enterprise zones have been working for years. Now we have to keep reinvesting in them and so they don't get neglected and go back to where they were. These were areas that were desolate and blighted, and now they're thriving, as you can see by the businesses that are here. I believe that this is a bill that it is like a middle of the ground. I think it's something what the governor would be willing to sign. Senator Nicholas Sacco sponsored legislation extending the UEZ program into North Bergen, Guttenberg, and West New York. And that was done in the mid-1990s. And it worked so beautifully. You could see the outcome. You could see businesses being established. This would be a big help to us. Mayor Felix Roque has nothing but praise for Sacco, the other mayors, and Speaker Prieto for making it all possible. He's spearheading this movement. I'm very proud of that because, you know what, uh, we have enough already on taxpayers' burden uh, to be spending more money. And with this project, we're able to reduce the burden. We're able to hire new police officers. And we're able to make uh, our towns better. He's mayor of the third largest city in New Jersey. And Jose Torres calls UEZ another tool for mayors in urban centers. These transformed environmentally challenging settings like the one where this announcement took place. Those are the carrots that uh, uh, national food chains and, and businesses are looking for to attract, to redevelop. Uh, we heard that over and over again, redevelop the site. And truth to the saying, you build it and they'll come. In North Bergen, Jillian Risberg, HCTV.